Welcome to my channel. If you like my videos, then kindly subscribe, like, and watch. Thank you. Welcome back. Problem seven point one zero two. A spherical gas container made up of steel having 12, 20 feet outer diameter and wall thickness of 7 by 16 inch. Knowing that the internal pressure is 7 psi, determine normal, maximum normal stress and maximum sharing stress in the container. So in given data we have, this is spherical gas container. and outer diameter is given as 20 feet so i will convert it into inch so 20 into 1 feet is 12 inch clear so that will be equal to 240 inch thickness is given as 7 by 16 inch and that is equal to 0 0.4375 inch clear also the internal pressure p is equal to 75 psi that is given so what we have to find we have to find the maximum normal stress maximum normal stress clear and the second part is maximum sharing stress so let's start with the solution as we know that uh, working stress sigma or sigma max is equal to sigma 1 is equal to sigma 2 is P into R divided by 2T for spherical pressure vessel. I will write it. Pressure vessel R you can say here it is given as gas container. Clear. Now we do not know R, so R will be equal to 1 over 2 D naught minus T. So 1 over 2 D naught is 240 inch minus T is 0 0.4375 inch. So we will get R is equal to 119.56 inch. So this R is inner radius while d naught over 2 is outer radius clear so you can put it in this formula so your maximum stress will be equal to p p is 75 psi r is 119.56 divided by 2 into thickness is 0 0.4375 so when you calculate it, you will get this maximum normal stress will be 10.25 into 10 to the power 3 PSI. Clear? Also, you can say that maximum normal stress is equal to 10.25 KS. So this is the answer of our first part now we will find the second part so in second part it is given as to find the maximum sharing stress okay so for maximum sharing stress what we will do is that we will draw the Mohor circle clear so if you have this horizontal axis as well as vertical axis so on vertical axis you will have shear stress and on horizontal axis you have the principal stress now this sigma max is equal to sigma 1 and sigma 2 i will write it sigma 1 is equal to sigma 2 is equal to 10.25 ksi clear clear and here the shear stress is equal to 0 applied shear stress is equal to 0 so if you plot this sigma 1 comma 0 so it will be for example if it lies at this point so this will be sigma 1 is 10.25 comma 0 will be this point and if you plot sigma 2 comma 0 both will be the same point 
clear so your more circle will uh, lie or your more circle will be just a point for this state of stress and again you can see the third stress which is sigma 3 and that is equal to 0 this is sigma 1 is equal to sigma 2 clear so if you draw a more circle for that for example if I draw a more circle for that passing through these points clear so your maximum sharing stress out of the plane will be this one this one will be your maximum sharing and I will write this will be your maximum sharing stress now this maximum sharing stress will be equal to 1 over 2 into sigma max which is sigma 1 or sigma 2 minus sigma minimum and sigma minimum is sigma 3 which is equal to 0 so you can put it 1 over 2 sigma max is 10.25 10.25 and sigma minimum is 0 which is sigma 3 I will write sigma minimum clear so 0 so again it will give you 5.12 KSI your maximum sharing stress which is for out of plane okay so maximum sharing stress uh, that is out of plane is 5.12 KSI. Clear? I hope you have enjoyed this video. Thank you for watching.